everybody. How you doing? Welcome to Color and Chat with Joanna. I'm Joanna. I'm trying to get my sleeves and I'm so, I'm so scaly. I, I feel like I'm molting. Anyway, um, hey, how you guys doing? Today's my favorite day. It's April 25th because it's not too hot. It's not too cold. And if you really want to go on the perfect date, all you need is a light jacket. <laughs> I know. No, every April 25th, I go and watch Miss Congeniality because I love the line from that movie, you know, because she really has such a, uh, this is how far we are right now. Look, we're, we got meringues. These are the other side of the meringues. I know. I'm going to be doing meringues till I'm dead. Anyway, um... I'm taking a break before I get started on the, I'm so sorry, the splash. Before I get, it, it has to tell me I'm breathing, you know? When did I need a watch to say I was breathing? Anyway, um, I got some mail and I wanted to share it with you. One is for my girl. My girl, I had to actually like read the label and go, a who? A what? And then I realized, oh yeah. I got friends in no places. It's a it's a Union Jack sundress. Isn't it so cute? Thank you so much, darling. I just love it. And it is so soft. And you know I'm going to live in it this summer. Um, because that and a swimsuit and a pair of sandals. And I'm, I'm good to go. But I also got something else. Um, okay, so it was packed like so. And then I opened it up, and then it was packed like so. And man, I had to dig it and dig it and dig it. And this is something um, I'm blaming Miss Rose Prophet on this because she's the one who got me all into this. I have never, I didn't know that you you could uh look at these cute little stickers look at the little misty bot oh god i don't know what i'm gonna do with it but it's gonna be fun um <clears throat> okay this is her card emily emily hold on a moment you'll you'll come into focus in one second maybe ah uh, my camera's so stupid okay Emily, um, oh, I'm so sorry. Um, Emily makes custom pens, and this is her information right here. If you want to take a screenshot, uh, custom pens by TJ. And um, I didn't know. I, I thought I was just like going to buy a pen. But apparently, these pens are a little well sought after. Now, I have never actually, this is the only pen I have that I, I kind of bought from a D stash. All my other pens are, you know, they're a little Walmarty, but hey, nothing wrong, you know, I'm okay with that. I just usually like a thinner pen. So, after I got it out of more, oh, she insulates the tar to these things. I'm telling you. She packs them and packs them and packs them again. And um, it's in a pretty little velvet bag. Ooh, bougie. Feels very much like jewelry. But then I opened it and I was like, oh, yeah, somebody, somebody. Don't look at my pruny hand. I'm so sorry. I didn't put any lotion on today. Has been drinking the Kool-Aid and oh, and I just did I break it? Oh no. <laughs> uh these are hand turned. It's all clear with this beautiful lavender color that you can see through. And then it goes to this like Bone ivory that has a really subtle glitter in it. Um, a metal tip, a metal tip. I love the metal tips. I do because you know they're they're much more reliable. And I cannot tell you 
how many? Like you get a plastic tip, you push down on it, it breaks off right here at the corner and the pen's dead. You can't get that plastic out no matter what you do. So I absolutely love it. Um, I don't know a lot about pins. This looks like almost like a mother of pearl. It's a beautiful, beautiful, uh, tone and, um, trying to get it up in the light. It's, ugh, these things are not easy to, uh, film, but I love that, you know, she looks like, you know, she looks like that girl. It's like, you know, get your life together. I already have my life together. Thank you. She has her life together. We don't need a bullhorn for her. Okay. Anyway, you should hear that when it goes on. <laughs> it makes George crazy. I love it. Um, there's a tiny bit of black in it. Lavender. I cannot wait. I have a diamond painting that was prop just made for this and it's not super um it's got like a texture to it kind of you know like a <sighs> stop it phone um it's like you are not walking enough steps no i know i'm not walking at all good lord what do i do about this these talking phones i'm being taken over by ai anyway I love it, Emily. I really do. Uh, it was a special treat. And um, you know what? I had to uh, vie for it. You know, I had to like, hey, girl, look, I need this pen. <laughs> and I'm so grateful that I got it. And I'm trying not to brag, but I'm bragging a little bit. I'm so sorry. Anyway, thank you so much. Just wanted to give you a little shout out. Say thank you for the pen and for the experience because I've never had a pen that I feel like was made for me. And so I, I'm very touched and I love it. Um, anyway, you guys are important to me. So be important to you. Take care of you. If you like the uh, little unboxing and the unbagging and everything, could you please give it a like? And if you really, really, really had fun, you can subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything. And I'll only bother you a little bit. I'm a little annoying, but I'm not like there. I'm not all there. But, you know, sometimes. Anyway, uh, take care of yourself and go get yourself a cool pen because, girl... There are pens, and then there are pens, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, she's beautiful. I love her. I love the way she feels. My fingers fit right in it, um, and I can't wait. You know, plus I can turn it. You know, I can just kind of flip it. So uh, let me know in the comments what you think about the pen. I would like to know, since I'm new to the whole pen world, I've never really been a penaholic. I've always been a diamond painting a holic and and a and a and God knows I have enough cover minders, but I'm kind of getting getting into the pen world. So tell me what you think. I'll talk to you guys later. Shine on. Bye.